And moving on to the world of sports. Five-time world champions Australia will aim to bounce back after their opening defeat to India as they take on familiar foes South Africa in Lucknow. Meanwhile, the Proteas are full of confidence after scoring a World Cup record 428 in their victory over Sri Lanka. Australia's batting let them down in the defeat to India in Chennai. No batter could score even a half century as the Aussies were bowled out for 199. They struggled against the Indian spinners and that remains a major concern for Pat Cummins' side. They have now lost six of their last seven ODIs. There were some positives through as Pacers Mitchell Stark and Josh Hazelwood gave India a real scare before Virat Kohli and KL Rahul took the game away from them. All-rounder Marcus Stoinis is available after recovering from a hamstring injury and he could come into the playing 11 in place of struggling Cameron Green. South Africa showed their batting might in their opening win over Sri Lanka. Three of their players scored centuries in that clash. They had in fact crossed the 400 run mark last month as well in their ODI series against Australia. They do have a psychological advantage over the Australians having rallied from 0-2 down to win that series 3-2. A victory against Australia will send out a real statement to their rivals. The 1996 World Cup winning coach Dave Watmore set up the clash in a conversation with Beyond's sports e uh, correspondent Isha Hanspal. Take a look. As recently as last month, mm. South Africa won the series, the T20 before yep. that as well. Yep. Uh, do you, would you say, and especially after their performance last game, uh, the highest World Cup score, would you say they go in as favourites in tomorrow's fixture? Uh, I think so. Um, Australia find themselves in a similar position to what England were mm -hmm. when they before they played their second game. But the difference is the opposition's a little bit stronger. They can make a change with Stoinis, but I've gone for the same team simply because he adds that bit of firepower with mm -hmm. the ball. Um, and they are pretty much orientated, uh, their attack is orientated with speed, with pace. Uh, surely Adam Zampa it can bowl better than what he did um, and Glenn, uh, Glenn Maxwell is more than a, a part-timer now you mm -hmm. know he really gives you an opportunity to bowl his 10 overs. Temba Bavuma the captain you know again mm -hmm. I think will his role would be to bat along and, and the others to bat around him certainly Quinton de Kock will, de Kock will be looking to attack Rassi van der Dusen is another one that uh, mm. you know, plays according to the uh, merits, although he's no slouch when he gets a start. Mm. And then you have you know, Aidan Markram who, who set the, uh, the, the, the world on fire in his last game. Mm. And then Hendrik Klaassen and um, uh, David Miller to mm. really put the icing on the cake. So they will want, Australia will want those to come in early. Mm. They don't want to uh, you know, have them coming late, which means there's a lot of right. runs on the board.